ஸ்ரீ குருபியோ நமக திஸ் இஸ் முத்து மீனாட்சி ஃப்ரம் பொன் வித்யாஷ்ரம் ஐ வெல்கம் எவ்ரி ஒன் டு த நெக்ஸ்ட் செஷன் ஆன் ரேஷ்னல் நம்பர்ஸ் பிஃபோர் மூவிங் ஆன் டு த சாப்டர் லெட் மீ ஆட் ஆன் அனதர் இன்ஸ்பிரேஷனல் கோட் டு திஸ் ப்ரெசன்டேஷன் தட் இஸ் ஆல் அபவுட் மேத்தமேட்டிக்ஸ் மேத்தமேட்டிக்ஸ் இஸ் நாட் அபவுட் நம்பர்ஸ் ஈக்குவேஷன்ஸ் கம்ப்யூட்டேஷன்ஸ் ஆர் அல்கர்தம்ஸ் இட் இஸ் அபவுட் அண்டர்ஸ்டாண்டிங் ஐ ரிப்பீட் இட் இஸ் all about understanding so the more you understand the better you will learn the concepts so please understand the concepts thoroughly and start working on it use this situation to work out the problems we'll move on to the next session on rational numbers here it is part 3 here we'll be solving some of the problems from exercise 1.2 to begin with the first problem from exercise 1.2 the question number 1 it is represent these numbers on the number line number 1 it is number 7 by 4 as soon as i say the number 7 by 4 you can understand that it is a positive rational number now the next one is minus 5 by 6 as soon as i say the number minus 5 by 6 it is a negative rational number so the number minus 5 by 6 will be present in between minus 4 by 6 and minus 6 by 6 this is the way to represent the number on the number line look at all the denominators all the denominators are 6 this is one of the way for representing the numbers on the number line we will move on to the next problem before moving on to question number 3 there is question number 2 it is a similar model of question number 1 it is again representation of number on the number line so you can try it now let me move on to question number 3 here the question is write five rational numbers which are smaller than 2 the required five rational numbers which are smaller than 2 are first one it is 1 1 is a rational number yes yes or no yes 1 can be written in the form 1 by 1 the next one is zero again zero is also a rational number we have discussed in property 1 that is in part 1 introduction i have given you that zero is a special kind of rational number the next numbers are 1 by 2 1 by 3 and 1 by 4 to conclude the required five rational numbers smaller than 2 are 1 0 1 by 2 1 by 3 and 1 by 4 we'll move on to the next problem the next problem is find 10 rational numbers between minus 2 by 5 and 1 by 2 before moving on to this problem let us discuss an important concept that is if they have given you any two rational numbers between two given rational numbers there are five infinite rational numbers that is you can find n number of numbers between two given rational numbers we'll discuss this problem here the given two rational numbers are minus 2 by 5 and 1 by 2 the first step is to find out the lcm for the denominators that is 5 and 2 so here minus 2 by 5 multiplied by 4 to the numerator and 4 to the denominator will give me the result as minus 8 by 20 similarly if i multiply 10 to the denominator and numerator of the rational number 1 by 2 i will get the result as 10 by 20 so 10 rational numbers between minus 8 by 20 and 10 by 20 are minus 7 by 20 minus 6 by 20 minus 5 by 20 minus 4 by 20 minus 3 by 20 Minus one by twenty, zero, one by twenty, and two by twenty. In this way, here I have converted the denominators twenty. You can also try it for any other numbers. We'll move on to the next problem. Next, it is question number five. Here again, the question is find five rational numbers between two by three and four by five. That is the first subdivision of problem number five. here the given rational numbers are here the given rational numbers are 2 by 3 and 4 by 5 so again the first step is 
to find the LCM. Whatever you do to the denominator, the same thing should be done to the numerator also. So, to get the denominator that is LCM as 60, I am multiplying 3 with 20. So, 2 by 3 multiplied by 20 to the numerator and the denominator will give me the result as 40 by 60. The next one is 4 by 5. Again, 4 by 5 multiplied by 12 to the numerator and denominator will give me the result as 48 by 60. Here, we, we need to find 5 rational numbers between 40 by 60 and 48 by 60. 5 rational numbers between 40 by 60 and 48 by 60 are 41 by 60, 42 by 60, 43 by 60, 44 by 60 and 45 by 60. So to conclude, I just repeat the steps alone. To find any number of rational numbers between two given rational numbers, step 1 is finding out the LCM. That is, you need to convert the denominators of the given rational numbers of the same number. Then you need to find out given rational numbers, any number of rational numbers between the two. We will move on to the next problem. So it is subdivision 2. So here the question is minus 3 by 2 and 5 by 3. Minus 3 by 2 and 5 by 3. Again the first step as I told you earlier it is finding out the LCM. Here the LCM is 6. So minus 3 by 2 multiplied by 3 to the numerator and 3 to the denominator will give me the result as minus 9 by 6 and 5 by 3 multiplied by 2 to the numerator and denominator will give me the result as 10 by 6. To conclude, 5 rational numbers between 9 by minus 9 by 6 and 10 by 6 are minus 8 by 6, minus 7 by 6, minus 6 by 6, minus 5 by 6 and minus 4 by 6. This is the way for finding the rational numbers between two given rational numbers. Now we will move on to the third subdivision. The given rational numbers are 1 by 4 and 1 by 2. Again the same method only. Here I have taken the LCM as 32. So I am multiplying 8 for 1 by 4 which is giving me the result as 8 by 32. For the next rational number that is 1 by 2 I am multiplying with 16 to the numerator and denominator which will give me the result as 16 by 32. To conclude, 5 rational numbers between 8 by 32 and 16 by 32 are 9 by 32, 10 by 32, 11 by 32, 12 by 32 and 14 by 32. <coughs> Next is question number 6. Here the question is, we have discussed in a similar problem in the same exercise. Same way, here it is write 5 rational numbers greater than minus 2. So, we need to write 5 rational numbers which are greater than minus 2. Required greater rational numbers greater than minus 2 are minus 1, 0, 1 by 2, 3 by 4 and 1. We will move on to the next problem. The last problem of this exercise is find 10 rational numbers between 3 by 5 and 3 by 4. The given rational numbers are 3 by 5 and 3 by 4. As I told you, the first step is to find out the LCM. Here I have taken the LCM as 160. So, 3 by 5 multiplied by 32 to the numerator and denominator will give me the result as 96 by 160. And 3 by 4 multiplied by 40 to the numerator and denominator will give me the result as 120. So required 10 rational numbers between 96 by 160 and 120 by 160 are 97 by 160, 98 by 160, 99 by 160, 100 by 160, 101 by 160, 102 by 160, 103 by 160, 104 by 160, 105 by 160, 106 by 160. This is the way for finding the rational numbers between two given rational numbers.
so to conclude we have just discussed part 1 that is introduction on rational numbers we have uh, discussed all the properties of rational numbers in part 1 in part 2 we have solved the problems from exercise 1.1 in this part we have solved the problems from exercise 1.2 this completes the chapter of rational numbers so I request everyone to go through all the concepts and start practicing it mistakes are the proof that you are trying so please keep trying keep trying and keep on trying till you are clear with all the sums thank you